Hey you guys, it's your girl Addie here, and I just want to clue you guys in for the new makeup that I bought today. So, I went to Dwayne Reed to buy some foundation, because I want to try something other than my MAC NW45 foundation, but I really couldn't find anything, so I ended up looking at some eyeshadows, and I found this cute one that I bought. Um, it was only $2.99, and I got it from Dwayne Reed. And it's by Wet n Wild, and it's Spoil Brat 336. So here it is, right here. Um, it's a purple color, and the black is kind of like a shimmery color, and the silver color. Um, I really love this color the most because, um, when I went to Sephora last week, I tried on this Dior silver eyeshadow, and it was like fifty six dollars, and I damn sure wasn't buying that. So, I loved how it looked. I loved how it looked with almost every color I blended it with and tried it on with. So, I was like, you know what? This gray or silver, it looks exactly like that one. So, I just picked up this one and the other two colors just came with the bonus. So, yeah. And also, the good thing about this eyeshadow that I really love is that inside of the palette, it says, like, eyelid and crease and brow bone. So, it actually shows you where every one should go but i'm probably not really gonna follow that because i really just bought this for the silver and the black so but i am going to do a tutorial using all three of the colors not in the same order as is shown here but i am going to be using all three of them so i might use the gray instead of for the brow bone i might use it for my lid or for the crease but i'm probably going to use it for the lid and the black i'm probably going to use for my crease and then the purple I'm definitely probably going to use for my brow bone. So, yeah. Okay, now the back of it um it also shows you how to put the eyeshadow on. So, that's a good thing too. And also it comes with two brushes. I don't know you won't be able to see it because it's black, but they're right down here. Okay. And another thing that I bought that I really saw, I've been meaning to buy it. But it's just that I haven't really, I just, I don't know what the hell I'm about to say. But anyway, um, I wanted to try eyelashes and I haven't really got to trying it yet. So I keep seeing this commercial for the Falsies um, Mascara by Maybelline. And I keep seeing it in my magazine ads because I, I subscribe to Teen Vogue and like ads like this. Always makes me want to try it. So... I bought it. Here it is. And I'm going to try this on as well. Here's the back. And it's front again. And this is how it's actually supposed to look. So when I do the tutorial, I'm going to gonna do this. So, yeah. So stay tuned for the tutorial coming up right now. Hey, you guys. So, um, from what I said before... Oops, I almost broke my nail. Okay, so from what I said before, um, I'm going to be using the Wet n Wild Spoil Brat 336 um, eyeshadow palette. So here is how it looks. I've got the silver on the lid, the black on the crease, and a little bit of the purplish pink for the brow bone. Okay, and let's start off. So for the lid, like I say, I'm going to use the silver. So I just take a little bit on my eyeshadow brush, like so, and then I apply it to my lid. And if you get any in your crease, um, just take a Q-tip like this, and dip it in a little bit of makeup remover, and just take out the excess that you have in your crease. Because the black is going to go in your crease. So you don't want to mix that already. So I have a little bit. Okay. So how does it look? This is how it looks. Okay. So now I'm going to take the black with this smaller eyeshadow brush. And I'm going to take a little bit. And that'll be for the crease. And I'm going to start from here on the outside and blend in this way. And just go into little, little bit of circles at a 
time. So just blending it, blending it in in circles. Okay. <laughs> Don't, well, try not to blend it in with the gray or the silver, whichever one you decide to use or whichever color that you're going to have at home. Okay, so see, I started from the outside and I brought it in. Okay, now I'm going to take another brush. Um, This is also my eyeshadow brush. This is, all, this is an Urban Decay little tiny brush that came in my Urban Decay palette. And I don't have any more eyeshadow brushes yet. So I'm going to be using this in the meantime. So I just take one of these sides and I put a little bit on it. Like I put this much on it. See, it's not even, it's not even that much. And then I do that for the brown bone. So we'll do that right now. And if you have any excess in the places that you don't want it to be, you do the Q-tip thing again. Okay, now when you place the purple or the pink, whatever, whichever color you, you're going to use, um, you blend it in with the black. Okay, and this is pretty much the entire look. So here it is right here. So we have the silver, the black, and the purple. And I love how everything just like blends in really nicely with each other. I guess that's why they chose these three colors together. Okay, so here are the colors again. The purple, the black, and the silver. Okay, now all I'm going to put on, you can use a little bit of, I wouldn't really recommend using liquid eyeliner because the main part that you want to show off is the silver. So you don't need any any black eyeliner. Um, if you can't live without eyeliner, I would suggest putting eyeliner on the bottom lid. But I'm not going to be putting on any eyeliner. I'm just going to be putting on a little bit of um, mascara. So for this one, I put on the mascara. And I don't even think you can see it that great. And I like it. It's fine. But for me, to, I, I like my lashes to be defined and bold. So if you're going to use this, I suggest you put this on first. And then you put on your other mascara that you have, which will be the, um, the one that makes your lashes more bold and bright and big if that's the look that you want to go for. I'm just going to put that on now. So this is how the wand looks. Oh, I mean. This is how the wand looks. And I'm just going to apply that to my eyelashes. Now, since I like my lashes to be bold and defiant, um, I use my Forever 21 Bold um, Mascara. Just lost my train of thought and this is it it cost me about like 2.99 and this is what this is what the wand looks like so there it is so I'll put that on and it just gives it that extra umph I would say and that's it. So I really hope that you liked it. This is my first eyeshadow tutorial. So tell me if anything that you would like me to do, any colors that you would like me to get, or any other palettes that you think are pretty cool. Um, oh, I would just like to say thank you for my new subscribers. And if you're watching this video and you like it, subscribe. Or comment below or like it or dislike it or tell me anything that you would like me to know or any questions that you have. Okay, so... Thanks for watching. Later.